So I'm starting with this first full look. Okay, I just went outside and took some pictures for my weekly style videos. And um, let me just get into the look and then we're going to try on a couple of other outfits with the same top, okay? I feel like for fall, go with a striped jumper top. I think it's just so cool, comfortable. I have the short sleeve one, a short sleeve one by DKNY with a little color detail here which I think is really really cool and fun so I feel like you can do a lot of different things with this I feel like this is a go-to type of sweater for me but this is a lighter weight sweater to help bring me into the fall so I'm going to show you how I decided to rock this so in a few different ways okay so one top one striped jumper top slash lightweight sweater and I'm going to give you a few looks for this okay so I put it together with my BB Dakota genuine leather leather skirt it's like leather and another material like another fabric so it's like a mix and i put the jumper on tucked it inside and decided to wear it with these older boots that i've had for a few years these um pointy toed boots that i'm sure you've seen me in before and i have my coach bag that I thrifted um, from Little Treasures Thrift Store here in Montclair, New Jersey. I thrifted it like two years ago and I love the color and I feel like it's never gonna go out of style. I could pack things in it. It's like the perfect errand bag or just hanging out with girlfriends type of thing. And I have my Tom Ford round sunnies, okay? So this is the first look. Ah! Okay, and I'm, now I'm gonna show you something else, okay? Let me see what else I can gather here. These Joe's jeans, uh, they're cropped. I love these because of that. Um, they're so funky. Like these are my favorite pair of jeans actually for like my everyday wear. And I'm gonna just put on these shuts sandals with these, these white shut sandals and just keep it fun, keep it cute, but also keeping it fall. Let's keep in mind it's fall time, okay? Well, it's nearing fall, okay? So really cool sunnies. I love these Izod. I think it's pronounced Izod for men. Okay, these are men's wear sunnies, okay, that I got for a really good price because I needed some white sunnies and these fit the bill. They were more affordable, affordable than like the Pradas that I was seeing or like the Balenciagas that I really wanted. So I, these were my, you know, second choice for what I can afford and I love them. They're, I'm so glad that I chose to buy these, okay? So these white sunnies, I feel like it's giving me you know, just a colorful, you know, I'm not necessarily letting go of, of summer just yet, but I'm accepting the fall. You know what I mean? Like I'm making it work. So, and then I'm just gonna add this like oversized Levi's jacket. I feel like it kind of funks things, things up a little bit and gives some contrast. Um, it makes things a little bulkier, but I feel like it's fun and it's playful, okay? So this is it with the denim jacket. Ah, and the hair is curly, okay? I'm having a little fun with the curls, okay? So it's all about the fun. And I'm gonna top this off with a really cool bag. Let's wear the Gucci coat for the afternoon. It's giving chic, it's giving lady, it's giving style, it's giving comfort, okay? Because these chef's heels aren't too high and they're so comfortable. All right, so this is the look. Ah! I'm heading out. The message of the day. Okay, let me take off these shades because it's time to get into the message of the day. So as I'm heading out, the message of the day, I actually have to go to work, okay? <laughs> so I put these two looks together before work today. I hope you guys really enjoyed them and I hope it's useful, okay? Um, the message of, of the day is that, listen, I am done with like allowing people to disrespect me, okay? <laughs> no more disrespect, you know? the same type of respect and consideration that I extend to you, I deserve the same and I am not accepting nothing less than that, okay? So if there's a point where my boundaries are constantly crossed, 
um, I'm hearing words that are not adding up to actions or actions that aren't adding up to words, you know, then I know it's time to reevaluate this connection or it's just time to let it go and, you know, let's just <laughs> go our separate ways because if we can't agree to disagree, if we can't find that middle ground of communication and, and honesty and openness and respect, then I feel like the relationship is going to be like a, a lot of a struggle, okay? So the message for today is no struggles. Like relationships, life is hard enough. Personal, interpersonal relationships should not be a struggle for most of the relationship, okay? Because it's okay to have disagreements, but how do we handle them? How do we come together and, you know, tune up the train so that it can choo-choo again, okay? Choo-choo, like the train needs to choo-choo. Oh my God, with that guys, I hope this was like a really good self-care tool for you guys for today. And your girl is gonna head on out. I'm gonna head to work.